Welcome to another Leader RC video. Today it's not RC cars. I'm going to be putting together this desk that I bought on Prime Day on Amazon. It's a big L desk. It's going to take up from that wall all the way to the edge of that. And this way, it's about the same width as this. So first, I have to take all of that stuff, all my Legos, all my electronics and stuff off of the desk so I can move it. I also think I'm going to move this just for a little bit more room when I'm putting it together. I think I'm going to do a time lapse of that just so it goes a little bit quicker. I'll put you up there. There's a nice big space that I so handily cleared. And let's start the time lapse. Okay, so I got the desk cleared off. It's surprising how small this looks without all the stuff on it. I think I'm gonna, I need to move it now. It's gonna just go over there temporarily. So I can put this together. I got all the stuff on my bed. I managed to move my entire Lego garage without a car falling off because they aren't really held in place that well. Um, yeah, I guess I'll move this, and I'll do a time lapse of that, you know, yeah, okay, here we go. Okay, so I got the desk moved out, I'm gonna leave all these cables here, one, because I really don't feel like organizing them, I love organizing things, I just... Do not enjoy organizing cables and also it's not really like in the way i mean i'm sure once i put this where it's gonna go i'll like have to move those out a bit farther but i guess time lapse of no not time lapse I'm gonna open it first show you what's inside before I do a time lapse. Mildly worried. There's a couple puncture marks like that. There's like four on the other side. I'm hoping it doesn't like damage the surface of the desk. I'm fine with like maybe a little chip on the edge or something. Like that's usually pretty easy to hide. But I'm hoping for no big chips. Or, you know, I'm hoping it goes together perfectly fine. This way. Nice. Ooh, styrofoam. I wasn't expecting styrofoam. <laughs> instructions. I need that. Now the only bad reviews on Amazon were they said the packaging was bad. So far this packaging is great. And they said that these I don't know what that is. They said that these ended up on the wrong side. So I'm hoping this is the underside of it. doesn't look like it because here let me move that that like triangle shape that edge goes in the corner yeah 
Okay, so I guess I'll unpackage this completely and then I'll start a time lapse again. And here we go. Okay, so I got the shelf portion, portion, portion of it put together, which sort of goes on the right hand side of the long side of the desk. It wasn't too difficult. I ended up getting one of my screwdrivers because it came with a tiny little screwdriver and this handle was absolutely killing my hands. This one has a bigger, size on the end so it gets in the phillips easier the handle's more comfortable and it's magnetic so i'm less likely to just drop the screws yeah it wasn't that hard i think i i, I need to take all these numbered stickers off but i think what's the next step so i just finished that now i'm putting together the so so it goes like this and then it goes like that i'm putting it together at the end of that and then i'm putting together the bars that go from the shelf and i should be almost done yeah well that's not very helpful it it's sort of it's it's four steps and then it just ends it's not gonna tell us anything else. Are there more instructions? No? I guess they assume you can figure it out. Which I probably can. Well, back to another time lapse of steps three and four, I guess. And then I'll figure out how to get the top on by myself. Which shouldn't be that hard. Can't be that hard to figure it out, right? But yeah, I guess another time lapse. Okay, quick little update. Did the shelf, did the left side with all the bars that hold up the surface, did the corner, so this like goes here, well in a way it goes there, and the bars go across to the shelf part. This was hard because it doesn't hold itself up and you have to put a screw in and an acorn nut and there's two on both sides <clears throat> so that was honestly like the hardest part so far this is surprisingly easy especially with my screwdriver you can do it with the screwdriver it comes with it's just gonna be a whole lot harder but um i still have to do the bars that come off the shelf and then you put all the frame together, put the surface on it, and I should be done. So I'm going to do a time lapse of that. I might stop it when I get all the frame together into, you know, like one piece, not three. And then I'll put the surface on. So yeah, another time lapse. <laughs> Okay, so that was a very 
quick time lapse because I realized, I mean, I got those two bars on. I had to move that stuff because this one goes really far out. But I realized there is an actual next page. My fingers were just like too sticky. And so it just flipped all the way to the end. So I guess there is instructions on how to put the whole frame together and put the surface on or the tabletop on. So I'm do that now. And yeah, another time lapse again. Okay, so apparently I took that last step as a video, not a time lapse. So you might not actually get it because I don't know if I'll be able to upload it to my computer. But if you don't, I'm done with the frame. I got everything in. I got these little, not even sure what these do, but I got those in. All that's left to do is, well, clean up because there's plastic wrappings everywhere and put the top on and then put it in the corner and then we're done. Yeah, so I guess I'll do time lapse, but the I can't decide if I'm going to flip it over to put the top on. I know that'll probably be easier, but I don't think I want to, so I think I'm just going to lay those on top and then lay on the ground and screw it in from underneath. Also, yeah, there's my cat. Yeah, hi. Okay. Now there should be a quick time lapse because all I'm doing is putting the top on. And then it'll be done. So time lapse. Okay, I'm like actually done now. Also, why, why is that there? <laughs> Whatever, I guess I can just, there we go. Okay, so I'm done. I still need to take off the, like the little white stickers here and there, but it's pretty solid. This gap here is pretty darn small. Some other desks I looked at it was like, it was small here, and then the gap would get wider. I'm glad it doesn't do that. But look at all this room. I'm not even sure what I'm going to put on that shelf. Probably like my Bluetooth speaker and stuff, but it's huge. So I'm going to, I guess, pick up some of this plastic wrapping. It's all over my bed, too. And then put it in the corner. And then it should be, and then, uh, yeah, I'll just pick up, put it in the corner, and then I'm done. So I think I'm going to do one time, one final time lapse. And I'll do like a final review. And then the video will end. So, the last time lapse. I promise. Okay, so I got it in the corner. <clears throat> still need to organize all those wires. Picked up all the plastic. There's still some tools on the ground. I'm not really sure what I'm going to do with them. But I can put this thing back now. And this is my, honestly, like RC stuff organizer. So, like, um, Got some tools, some springs, this rubber made that's got stuff in it. So if you ever hear me like open a drawer in one of my RC videos, it's that thing. But this is like three to why is it so zoomed in? I'm trying to I'm trying to zoom it out without getting this stupid little knob in the way, because I have it on my tripod. It's so much bigger. This is like really close to my door now. I guess I 
can shove it a little bit closer to the desk. Yeah, look at that. Perfect. Give my chair back, which I want a new chair. Nice, look at all that space. Now I've gotta clean all this stuff up. Maybe take the box out. Um, and then I'll, I'm not gonna do a time lapse of that. I'll just stop the video and come back to it, start a new video. So I'm gonna do that now. So my cat is back. So yeah, I guess next time you see it, it'll have all that stuff on it. This box will be gone, those tools will be gone, those wires will be somewhat organized. So I'm gonna do that and come back. Okay. <clears throat> I got everything for the most part where I wanted. I might change a couple things here and there. Got all my Legos back. I ended up putting my keyboard and my mouse and my speaker down there. I put my box, which has a switch for my Christmas lights. The lava lamp was plugged into it, but that's really the only place I can put it besides on the ground where the lava lamp can reach it. So I'm just gonna have to go down here and switch off the lava lamp with that. But at least I can still control the Christmas lights with it. I still have like a couple things. I need to find a place for the extra screws because it came with one extra screw of each size and an extra nut and the screwdriver and the wrench. I unfortunately, because this desk as a shelf, I could use this, but now I don't really have anywhere to put it. I guess I could clip it to like this thing, but I think I want to get rid of that thing. But I don't know, I'll figure something out. I just know I would like more lights when I do, you know, RC videos here. Eventually I'm gonna get a shelf that goes somewhere on this now very blank space of wall. And all these Legos, or at least all the regular size speed champions are going to go up there. So I'm going to have a shelf there. And then I'd like another one somewhere here. So I'm going to move around posters, maybe get rid of a couple. And that'll be like, I don't know, maybe one of these plants. A couple other things. But I'm happy with it. I took all the little white stickers off. It's a very sturdy desk, like... I could probably sit on it, honestly. Oh yeah, I'm sitting on it. Look at that. It's very strong. Um, it's perfect. This it's a perfect size. I kind of wish it was like a few inches deeper, but I guess. I mean, I can't really. Re I guess I could return it, but that's such a little thing to return it for. So. Yeah, so far, great desk. Nice little shelf, nice big workspace. I kind of wish this corner was an actual corner, but I mean, I guess I can like route some wires up through there. And I got some wires. I'd like to get some cable management at some point because this is like everywhere. But yeah. I guess I will see you in the next video, which I already have planned. I got some links for the honcho. And I'm actually probably going to make that video like right after I finish this one. So look forward to that video, but see you in the next one.